Hello, my name is Lewis and welcome back to Gathering the Magic. And today we have a set booster box. Now, before we get into this, please do like this video and subscribe for more future Magic the Gathering content. And we're going to do the same again as we did in the last video. So in the last video, we hid the prickly marmoset somewhere and this prize of one booster pack will be going to the person that is on screen now and we will direct message you on Instagram, so be looking for that. And this time again, we will hide Prickly Marmoset somewhere and the winner will get a pack of the Set Booster. So again, what you've got to do, you've got to message us directly on Instagram with the exact timestamp of where you saw the Prickly Marmoset. And again, we'll pick a winner at random and you will get a Set Booster pack. So let's get straight into this. I'm really, really looking forward to doing this. So we've got the art card there, which is just lovely. We've got the planes. And yeah, I think there's a, I think there's a couple of percent chance of getting four mythics in a pack, which would be really, really cool. There's our first alternate. And oh my God, what a first pack. We've got Nissa. Nissa, oh, that's insane. Okay, yeah, <laughs> please do hit that like button, subscribe and yeah. That's a, that's a good sign. And we've got another rare. We've got a rare and a mythic in one pack. That is really, really good stuff. And are we going to get, no, we're not. We've got a copy token. We've not got something from the list. I really hope we get something good from the list. That'd be really, really cool. We're going into pack two. I think it's 30 packs, isn't it, per set. And are we gonna get one of these art cards with the golden signature on it, the golden ticket. And let's flick through all these commons, uncommons, and get to that rare, which is a relic robber. Not too bad, but nothing fantastic. We'll put the four there, and we've got our first list card. Like I said, I think it's meant to be one in every four packs. That is nice. We've got the wizard, patron wizard. Very nice. Let's put let's put the wi the wizard. Let's put the list card in its own pack there. Uh, just like the last video, let me know in the comments below uh, what your best pull from the set booster box has been. Obviously, uh, I'll let you know mine has been Nissa. And there you go, prowling Felida. And the rare for this pack is the Kazandu Mammoth. We got we got in the last in the last pack, but still a really cool DFC card. And another rare, it's a foil rare, Felidar Retreat. There we go, let's put them with the rares and move to the next one. From what I've heard, the set booster has been very popular. I think there's rumors that it will replace the draft booster in the future. And we've got here, ah, some magic games that you can get. That's pretty cool. Uh, lovely art there. The, arts, the art cards, really, really nice. I mean. I don't see the point in them at all myself, but really nice cards nonetheless. Prowling Felidar and Arch Priest of Iona. There we go, living that party life and not a good oil. Let's see what this mini game is. Again, feel free to pause if you want to uh, look at what this mini game is. <laughs> yes, as I was saying, uh, someone would have won a uh, draft booster from that last box and uh, yeah, um, do let us know if you see the prickly marmoset, put the timestamp. And here we go for the next one. I think if you did want to go back and check, I think the prickly marmoset was somewhere around the nine, nine minutes, 15 mark, somewhere like that. And a myriad construct, wicked, wicked card. Big fan of this. Very cool card. And the foil. And we've got another list. We've got Root Runner. Looks like from Champions of Kamigawa. Put target land on top of its owner's library. I'm not really too sure because I've not looked at the list in general. I think it's about, I think it's about 300 cards. I'm not sure what the, uh, there you go, lovely little art. I'm, I'm not really sure what, if there's a theme to it, if it's just like mystery booster, it's just a load of random, random ones, but who knows. Felidar Retreat. Oh my God, that is wicked. Where am I putting this? It's 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 a rare, but it's a full art foil. That is that is lovely. Oh my God, that's absolutely beautiful. It's 
spectacular. And for anyone worried, the second this video finishes, well, there's another game for you. The second this video finishes, I will be sleeving these bad boys up. There we go. I'm actually doing this from a different location today. Um, so yeah, not my usual setup. So I might get invaded by a dog at one point. Let's hope not onto the next pack. Now we're gonna get another mythic. Obviously there's less packs, so there's less in a oh, and here we go, Null Priest of Oblivion. I was about to say, in a way, there's less chance to find rares because there's less packs, but you do have more chance. You technically have a chance to find four, four rares per pack. But doing my research and looking on the box, it's something like a 3% a chance, I think, to get four rares in a pack. So I don't see it happening in this video. Land and let's go through. It's also only 12 cars instead of 15, which... I'm not really a fan of, but I guess it's going to give you a chance of better cards. So, and Academe's Awakening again. That was, I mean, I was very excited when I pulled that the other day. And I'm still excited. It's a wicked, wicked card. <laughs> Something I really, oh, yeah. When you uh, when you get so excited, you accidentally knock over your camera. <laughs> As I was saying, Agadine's Awakening, really, really cool cards. Obviously another Mythic. Can't wait to uh, to use two mythics so far nearly a third of the way in obviously we want to go for the sort of standard you want oh look at that that is very nice yeah obviously you want four to six four to six uh, mythics is what you sort of get in in a booster box so that's what we're aiming for and the rare is ancient green warden and it's another mythic and a really really cool land graveyard recursion card which again, I think that is going to find a home in my Radder deck. I'm not going to call it my Nissa deck this time like an idiot. And we've got another card from the list. We've got Tree of Tails. Wicked. Artifact Land. Cool. The list is throwing up some pretty, pretty cool things so far. And now the 10th pack. 10th out of 30, I believe. Okay, there we go. Not got any of those gold sign lands yet but oh foil island but yeah we've got got a few mythics so far got a few really cool cards let's see what we're gonna get in this one pi Phylaf world sculptor not pilaf Phylaf. another really cool again plant plant landfall shenanigans saw that in the latest game nights that's pretty pretty fun and here we go another mini game if you want to uh if you want to play. Let's move this back over this side. And away we go. So yeah, what what are everyone's thoughts? Do you prefer the you know the standard, the normal draft booster, another foil? Or do you think you'll become a fan of the set booster? I'm not really sure so far. Again, started off hot with that Nissa. Oh, okay. I like the set booster. I've changed my mind just now. That is so cool. <laughs> the alternate art, or the alternate style, Morag, Fury of Acom, that is a hell of a card. Oh my God, that's brilliant. There we go, and not, we've, not had, we've not had those four rares in a while. And, oh, what's this? Ah, oh, it's another list, and another artifact creature. Arcbound Slith with Modular. Nice, another old classic card there. So we're currently on four lists four lists very nice okay moving on to the next one. Oh god absolutely butchered that oh that is nice there we go nissa there we go nissa making a second appearance in the booster box okay are uh, we gonna get something something really rare we're we gonna get another mythic that dread worm that loves to make an appearance and another again Packed it the other day, but a beautiful double-sided pathway. And it's probably one of my favourite ones out of all of them. There we go. I quite like the red, red, is it red blue? The kite sail pathway. Ghastly Gloom Hunter. And in case you didn't know how to play, there you go. I definitely meant to sound more sarcastic than not. Uh, <laughs> okay. 
Again, still waiting, still waiting for that gold uh, signed card. Uh, to be fair, I won't get too excited about it, but I'd, you know, that's quite a like one. I don't know if you guaranteed them in these boxes or not, but we go and Vera's all again. Very, very nice. And a double rare, there we go. This is why we want the set boosters, double. And that's why I want a flying death touch lifelink. Ah, oh, come on, give me, give me four rares. Allied assault and garbage. Now the big question is, I don't know how far along we are, but 10 minutes into the video so, has the prickly marmoset turned up or not? Has he showed his face? We shall see. Let's have a look. With the art card again, I don't know what I'm gonna do with all these art cards. Really cool idea in principle, but I don't know, maybe you could use them instead of a instead of a card, something different. Inscript of Insight, cool kicker rare, and a foil field research. Oh, oh, and we've got another list. Ah, oh, wicked, wicked. Perfect sort of car for that mere folk tribal. Rivals of Ixlan, Simic, Mere Folk, Mist Binder. Very nice indeed. There we go. You gotta, you gotta neaten up the piles every once in a while. Otherwise, it just gets a bit too out of hand. Yeah, I don't think I've seen any duplicates of the art so far, which is cool. And again, I'm not sure how many, how many different art there is to, to collect. But I'm sure the people who love to collect. Oh, Throne of McKindy. Again, I mean, this this was a set that was aimed towards collectors. So I guess that is sort of perfect marketing by Wizards because, again, it's something extra to collect. Okay, looking at the back, there are 81. 81 different cards to collect. I don't think the value is very high on them. I think, they're, I think they might already be about 50p, 50 cents each, which is next to nothing to collect oh that is that is nice again they, they are they are really really nice ah it's like nice but nice but pointless but nice okay i feel i'm feeling a mythic i'm feeling another mythic in this one. Oh my god jesus christ <laughs> i was feeling a mythic i wasn't quite feeling this jesus oh my god i didn't think i could top getting omnath in the last pack an even better omnath Oh my god, I don't even know how much this is going for, but if the other one's going for like 30, oh wow, wow where we were. And we've got another Nighthawk Scavenger, two rares, oh I thought we were going to go for the four then. Oh what a pack, what a pack, oh I don't even mind that you're just a token. Another Omnath, wizards just keep giving... Okay, I did it again. I got so excited, I literally knocked my camera off and stopped the recording. Oh, okay. Calm, calm. It's okay. And there we go. Another, I think that's an art of the path, one of the pathways. Oh my god. Another Omnath. Another Omnath. That's incredible. An even better Omnath, you might say. Oh, what? Add a Lotus Cobra. The pack that just keeps on giving. And there we go, foil, cleric, and nothing special there. Now I've got to say, I'm nearly two thirds, nearly two thirds in, and I'm enjoying the set booster so far. This is a, uh, this is some good going. Let's put these over here, and let's get through the commons, doing commons. Because whoever wants to see them, canopy balos, and the rare is Angel of Destiny, wicked card again. Packed it the other day, but it is. A wicked, wicked card. Not too overpowered, and yeah, just pretty, pretty cool. And we've got another simple guide. Although I'm pretty sure within every box they have the 12 sort of step instructions, so I guess players can can learn on the go. And we've got another beautiful art there, swamp. And here we go. What are we gonna get this time? It's been a wicked opening so far. Legion Angel is the rare. Not had a double, not had a double rare in a few packs. And we've not had the four rare yet. Although, like I said, 3% chance it's not looking likely. 
Okay, here we go. What are we gonna get? And it's Luminarch Aspirant, and I can see. Oh no, I thought I saw. I thought I saw a card from the list then, but no. Got a rare, oh, double rare, Inscription of Abundance. Very nice. There we go, there's the double rare. I'm a happy bunny. <laughs> Did I really just say that? If you are still watching, put in the comments, hashtag I'm a happy bunny. Okay, here we go. So many copy tokens. They're really trying to push that from Korea. And there we have Jace, Jace the man. Okay. Okay, let's get through it. Let's get another mythic. This is a mythic pack, isn't it? This is a mythic pack. This is not a mythic pack. It's just a rolling vortex. Okay, and turn timber aesthetic and not a list. Okay, if my maths is right and it's 30 packs, you should probably get about seven cards from the list. And oh, there we go. First signature. Very nice. Good stuff, that's one gold signature. Okay, yeah, so yeah, you should get seven cards from this, but about seven, if it's four, like one in every four. River Glide Pathway for the rare. Lovely, lovely stuff. Lava Glide, yes, this is the one I was on about with the, with the glider, very nice. Although I would like it in, a, in that full version. Foil, foil royal, and no list. Okay, we got we got five lists so far, so two more, and I'll be happy. Card, foil, swampy, and we're moving on through. And here we go. The rare is Taziri, wicked card. Saw it on again the latest game nights, and actually did. I mean, no spoilers, but it did better than I thought it would, and. Alpha Carvu, or oh, here is an old card. Again, it's nothing. It's nothing special. I really want to get some real big dog list rare. But yeah, Taz Taz Tazri Taziri is a yeah cool card. But again, I've said it before. I'm not ever. I can't see myself getting into the pirate mechanic. I get they're doing it as a sort of little tester before the D and D set comes out next year, but. Not something I'm interested in. Another Throne of McKinney and a double rare. Magmatic Ch Channeler. Magmatic Channeler. The rare is Utility Knife. And what is the list? It is something I've not seen in quite a few packs. Oh no, wait, I saw it last pack. What am I about? I'm getting all disoriented. I'll tell you what, these do feel like they open up differently. Uh, okay, there's our first copy of a copy of an art. Yeah, these do kind of feel like they open up differently to to a normal pack. And again, if you do want to open one of these for free, oh, Charix, another crab, another crabby boy. Oh, yes, the crab team is coming together. Foil. Uh, yeah, like I'm saying, if you do want to win a pack of this yourself, just look out for the Prickly Marmoset. DM us on Instagram exactly what timestamp you saw it, and you will get a pack sent right to your door here we go wicked art island and let's bash through these canyon draboa legion angel again an expedition Sto skulker not stalker expedition skulker okay four packs left are we going to get one more mythic just one and there is Jace chilling. We saw him hard at work earlier, now he's just chilling. Okay. And the rare is Nimble Trap Finder. Again, really cool card. Got some good play. And a Thieving Skydiver. The double rare. The double rare. Oh, I was hoping it was going to be the triple. Let's try and play it cool. Well, three packs left. And we've had seven mythics so far. That is, that is insane. That is better than your average box. And... I said I wasn't going to get excited about the art cards, but we've got Omnath. Maybe that will just be sort of like I'll use that instead of instead of my Omnath in a deck. There we go. I'll, I'll proxy with an art card. To be fair, that could that could be a pretty good use for for the cards. Cool little cool little proxy. Nimble 
trap finder again. And, ah, uh, nah, never mind. And not another one. Come on, two packs left. I want one more list. One more list. And you know what? This is going to be a list. I called it, I called it with a mythic. And this is the list. And this is going to have two rares, this pack. This is a two pack rare with the list. You heard it here first. But yeah, again, from what I've seen so far, I definitely prefer this, I think, I think I prefer this to, ah, uh, it's the rare. Is it the double rare? No. <laughs> but it is the list. It is a list. There we go. Calming, oh, there we go. Calming Lycid. Loses this ability and becomes creature enchantment. Mm. Good, good stuff. Got the list. There we go. And Akiri. No, you don't go in the mythic pile. What are you doing? Okay, here we go. Yeah, this has been this has been a really fun box to to crack. I definitely would consider doing it again. You know what? I'll go 20, 25 likes and I'll do it again. 25 likes, I'll do it again. I'll try, <laughs> I'll try 54. I'm not at that level yet. I'm not at that level. Kazandu Nectar Pot. Let's take our time for this last one. Zareth San the Trickster. Nice. And a Prowling Belladar alternate foil. And a nice fun game for us to play. Booster Blitz. There we go. Well, we'll flick through the Mythics now. As always, thank you guys for watching. Please do hit that like button and subscribe. Really help out our channel grow and grow. And uh, yeah, for now, I am all tapped out. So I'll see you and Omnath in the next video.